Hello, I am Fate Touched, and this is me playing games. At least, that's the plan. Let's start the game. I lock. Here at the Final Journey Hotel, on this night of the November full moon, we enter the battle for power over Earth. We will fight, and lay down our lives until the end. Answers will be revealed. Victory will be sealed. Well, that definitely had a different tone to it than the last four games. Yeah, this is five. Apparently, we are no longer in a time-traveling hotel. Apparently, we have nothing to do with Lovecraft anymore. Now it appears we have something to do with two warring factions of mages, question mark? I guess we will see. Ah, and we've gotten into casual, advanced, hardcore. This is good. That means hopefully in the next couple of games, we will be at the point where we can do customizing and they don't have to do the tutorial. Several years ago, I met a remarkable man named James. A common name to be sure. But this particular James is quite unique. A detective, a courageous man, a noble mentor, and my friend. Together, we have cracked dozens of cases, and he never, ever ceases to amaze me. We certainly make quite a team. Hello, old friend. We have a new case to crack. This one's at a hotel. Sounds exciting. All of the details are in the letter I sent. I've totally played this demo before. You made it. Good thing, too. This one sounds tough. Something really strange is going on around here. This girl is a witness, but she is too scared to talk, and I don't want to leave her alone. Could you go find me a medical bag? No, interactive health. Good, thank you. He doesn't look great, I will give you. He wouldn't look bad if he had a different haircut. He's definitely supposed to be like discount Sherlock Holmes. Let's see what we got here. Chess piece. He's not. That's not nice. Also, he has generic um, hot guy voice actor. I don't know who any of the voice, voice actors are, but I have heard him in multiple games. Apparently my voice is going to come in and out. That's helpful. We don't want Sherlock Holmes. Isn't that something that like lots of people want? Generally speaking. I'm not paying attention. We want photo dad. I know you guys want photo dad. I'm sorry. We can't do photo dad yet. I don't want to do two back to back uh, episodes of a game. Because, wait, oh, there it is. There's more cliffhangerness? I don't know. I can't have that in the last pipe. It's not even hidden. Oh, wait, I just saw something. Where is it? Nope, maybe not. Oh, it must have been that. What am I missing? <laughs> 
Well, tell your hamster that he needs to have better manners. Or she needs to have better manners. Ah, there it is. Looks like someone's sewn a little hiding place here. Do I get to keep that jewel? No, I guess not. Okay, we have the medical bag. Oh, yay! The first game of these with a lock on it. Speaking of locks. Look, see, now it won't keep going down and up and down and up and making me dizzy. What did he just give her? He gave her like a little tiny bottle. Was it booze? I need a bat. Sorry, I got distracted by the bat. You're safe now, my dear. Now, can you tell us what happened? Did you notice anything unusual? Please, try to remember. You probably won't believe me, but I'll tell you anyway. The guests here are all... monsters. And they're having some kind of battle or something. I know it sounds crazy, but... I swear it's the truth. Is she wearing a t-shirt underneath her outfit? Hmm, curiouser by the moment. Do you happen to have a key to the hotel? We'd love to take a look around. One would hope she has a key to the hotel. Oh, sure. Here's the key to the front door. But I'm getting out of here. I won't stay in this crazy place a second longer. I'll examine the hotel exterior after I make sure the young lady gets away from here safely. Why don't you head inside and take a look around? You want me to do the scary part? Sure, why not? Rather not damage the sculpture, I just need to clear the vines. Okay, I wasn't planning on damaging the sculpture. That's a bit chilling, but perhaps I can use the nails. That's kind of creepy. Uh, okay, we need a candle and a hammer and cutters of some sort. An aspen branch? Those trees don't even grow around here. Huh? Okay. And I need something... Oh, a flashlight on the bat. That's a cute bat. You be nice to the bat. Oh no. That's a werewolf. Is this going to be werewolves versus vampires? Dissolve the lock completely. Oh, I can open the door. Duh. You've broken the rules of battle this time. <laughs> Victors are judged and losers aren't remembered. Oh, you'll pay for this. Okay. Not vampires versus werewolves. Apparently, tuxedo mask versus random phantoms. Huh. Hey, the animation's better than the first four games. Why is everything always missing handles in these places? Why is there a room boarded up in this hotel? Why does this hotel look like it hasn't been used in centuries if there was someone working here? These are questions that I ask myself and I don't know answers because there aren't any answers. Why is there a saw hanging on the side of the mailbox? Uh, can I use the saw on the vines? That's a better question. Nope, okay. Ooh, and I can take the boards. What do I need boards for, I wonder? There's an arrow in that chair. Panel is well fastened with screws. Okay. There's another bird in there. I need a key for that. I guess so. 
there's like claw marks here. Ah, there is a wolf. Maybe there are werewolves. Guess we shall see. I should take care wandering around this hotel, you think? Okay, what did I need the screwdriver for? Oh, I needed it for the door. I mean, it's an interesting game. I have to find the right parts. How? Why did somebody screw the plate back on if the parts weren't there? I guess there's nothing to read in this game thus far. I had candy corn. I think I'm talking faster than I normally do. A vampire can hardly remember his age, but his surprise attack makes you doubt his amnesia. When you speak of a vampire, cold-bloodedness is not only a figure of speech. Okay. Oh, I guess we're collecting monster pictures in this one. Sure, why not? I have another screwdriver. Can I use a screwdriver on you? Yes. Why did I do that? I thought I was supposed to fix that bird. My candy corn addiction is not tearing this family apart. My candy corn addiction is making me slightly more hyper than I normally am. Ah, werewolf. Called it. A, represent a representative of the old kin, a true werewolf is capable of immediate transformation to wolf and back. It combines grace of manners and a wolf's grip. Hope there aren't a hundred of those since the counter is at 99. All right, we have screws, a screwdriver, we have boards, and we have a tile. Can I take this off? No. That I need to screw something on to. This I need pieces of. Uh huh. Right. Uh, I can't do anything there. That's a nail. Can I use the screwdriver on the nails? Yeah, I didn't think so. I need a light for that. Yeah, 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 yeah. Actually, now that I've mentioned it, I imagine if my children are listening, that they're going to end up here asking for more candy corn. But I'm streaming, so they can't have any until I'm done. What am I supposed to be doing? I'm lost already. I need clippers for this. I need a candle for that and a hammer. There's nothing over here. I need like acid for that, a flashlight, a rose thing. I don't know what I need for them. I need, like, openers for that. Can I just put screws in there? See, that would work. You could just screw the screws in and pull it open with your fingers. That was not a call to actually summon you. You can't have any candy corn until after the stream is over. Can I put that on there? No, I guess not. No, you can't have any candy corn either. You're in North Carolina. Which is far away from where I am, so, no. What is that word at the top there? Is that supposed to be decor? decor? D, capital A with a tilde, copyright sign, C-O-R. Somebody look that up. <laughs> <laughs> what am I supposed to be doing? Okay, time for a hint, because I have no idea. Use the screwdriver to get parts from the bird sitting on the clock. I thought I needed to open the door. Oh, there's no door there. Okay, that's my bad. Aw, we have a kitty cat joined us. Everybody say hi to the kitty cat. Okay, now what? I don't fasten them. Oh, how are they sitting there now? Oh. Yeah, they failed at that. Oh my, this is a murder scene! That was definitely a vampire. Legend says this is how to kill a vampire. Is that what happened here? He has fangs. What do you think? 
Seems like there's something missing from the ring. Maybe this is... Oh, I forgot about him. What just happened? Oh. Well, we're even worse here than I thought. It appears we've got a cold-blooded murderer on our hands. Based on the cause of death, the victim appears to be a vampire. Uh. I found this while searching the hotel. Maybe we should split up so we can cover more ground, but I won't go far. Wait, were you here the whole time? Nice to help. Okay, we need a flower for that. Oh, that's pretty cool. I guess this goes there. Yeah, I want that. That looks cool. It's not easy to break a sword, especially a silver one. And what's it doing in the vampire's room? Not a lot, since he's dead. Oh, look, he had acid. How nice of him. There's dust covering what looks to be a code. Okay. Oh, oh, but we're missing one of the numbers. Okay. That's a cool box. That's Egyptian again. Look, see? That's a scarab beetle with wings. Yeah, 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 I know. The guest staying in this room must be afraid of sunlight. Well, he did a horrible job of blocking the sunlight. There's giant curtains he could have closed. Okay, so now we have acid so we can open the mailbox, because that makes sense. I don't think that's how acid works. What is that? Oh, it's just paper. And a bat! We don't get to read the newspaper? Lame. Ah, uh, the bat goes on this dude. And we get a cool knife. A dagger. Ah, uh, did we need to cut something? Probably. Oh, we need to cut the vines in the front of the hotel. Kind of disappointed we didn't go with more love crap. That was lots of silly business. There's nothing where his eyes should be. I mean, do gargoyles always have eyes? Twilight Brothers coat of arms. Grey Order coat of arms. It is werewolves and vampires. Just some of them are dressed like tuxedo mask. Oh, what is all this nonsense? Wait, what? Oh, oh, you cut down the trees. You blow up the mountain. You bridge the river. You crossbow the crossbowers? Sure, why not? And over here, another bridge. And honey for the bear? <laughs> I would have gone with a crossbow, but I guess I like bears, so. These guys are coming from over here. Okay. Do I have to do these guys separate? I'm confused. Maybe I just have to pour water on the fire? Oh, I guess they both have to be right for this to work. Yeah, okay. And now it's night. <gasps> the eclipse! Oh, that's the name of the game. Ha <laughs> ha I knew that. Ooh, we get to make a puzzle. Let's see. Oh, you're in the way. You probably go up there. Where's the rest of the door? There it is. This is a cool puzzle. Alright, 
hang on. Oh, that's not part of the house. I think that goes like over here somewhere though. You probably go up there. Why is it always werewolves and vampires? Aren't there other like cryptids that don't like each other, generally speaking? Oh, I just realized there's an outline of the house there I can use as a guide. Haha, <laughs> I knew that. Why, though? I mean, Bigfoot is kind of like a werewolf, except it's a bear. Lizards are slightly more interesting. I don't think they know each other like that. I, I don't understand how, well, okay, dogs are cute, I guess, is one way to look at the werewolves thing. I don't understand how they're sexy, though. They probably smell like dogs. You have a wet werewolf in your house? That does not sound appealing. I have not seen a statue of Mothman with a fine booty. No, you are correct. I'm not interested in seeing that either. But now, of course, I'm going to have to look because you mentioned it. Because I haven't learned that lesson yet. What? What about unicorns and fawns? I missed that part. Should fight to the death. Yeah, no, that's not fun. Ooh, look, a pretty butterfly. Why did the vampire have a light butterfly in his room? Seems like that would be counterproductive. A flutterfire. That is so cute. I don't know what I'm going to use it for, but it's adorable. Oh, I can use it to light the lamp. I'm going to put it in a different cage. How nice of me. Oh, no. Good. That's not what I wanted to do. Because that's not nice. Oh, I can chase the bat away with it. That's fine. That doesn't hurt the bat or the butterfly. Oh, I get to keep the butterfly. Maybe I am going to lock it up. Oh, good. Okay. I guess so. I mean, it's good animation, I gotta say. I can't complain about that. Alright, let's see what this is. Can I? No. I hate it when you can only go in one direction because I always miss a number. Can I? No. Wait. Am I going backwards? Five. Four. No, I'm not. Stupid dyslexia. Okay. Ooh, another skull thing and a door handle. Hmm, this card seems to be protected by a magic spell. Oh, I remember this. There's like cobweb covered things all over the place and you need like a special thing to make them go away. I definitely played this demo. It was a long time ago though. I would say anything. Yeah, it is actually, I think. But it's like a magic feather duster. I would say anything that's fake is a cryptid, isn't it? Or not fake, unknown. Maybe they have to have sightings to be encrypted. I'm not entirely sure what counts as that. I kind of thought they were all mythological creatures, but probably that's incorrect. Can I use this on here? Good. Well, I mean, it would be more convenient, but I don't care. Stupid thing. All right, we did that. We can't go in here yet. Can I scare them away with the butterfly? No, I think I need that giant scythe to scare them away. What? I am not a meow meow, whatever it is you're talking about. All right, the only thing I can do here is I need a hammer and a candle, I guess, since I can't put the butterfly in there. And I need another handle for that. And I need a key for this. And I need more skulls for that. There's nothing over here. I need that magic wand or feather duster or whatever it is for over there. What am I missing? Oh, you know what? Is there a map in this one? No, no map.
Can I unscrew the window? No. Huh. All right. Now you can light the candle on the desk in the vampire's room. I didn't know I needed to do that. I also wasn't paying attention that there was a candle there. Am I still keeping it? Oh, yep. Okay. I thought for a minute. Wouldn't it have made more sense to put the candle in the lantern and then light it instead of wandering around with a lit candle? There's the other ring, another skull. This calls for a rune of some sort. R is for rune. This one is a lot more straightforward than the other games. Though it's not really entirely obvious what you're supposed to be doing all the time. Definitely starting to look like more of the modern games, though. I mean, the Time Traveling Hotel was, in fact, way more interesting than all of this other stuff. But, unfortunately, we have left it behind. All right, let's see. Fan, shell, three bracelets. That's a watch. Oh, did I need a watch, too? Oh, I need more. Three watches, too. Okay. That's a necklace. There's a bracelet. Watch. Watch. Bracelet. I also need a flower. Flower, flower, flower. Flower. A heart and a photo. It's all a photo. Oh, there it is. And a crown and a mask and a skull. Crown and a mask and a skull. Where's a skull? What else do I need? A heart and a skull. Lots of butterflies in this picture. Letter buys. Oh, there's the last piece of the necklace. Oh, I gotta break the piggy bank. So mean. You have cake? Locke isn't sharing her cake. I don't think that's nice. Why can't I find the skull? It's like, that's not a skull. I mean, any kind of, oh, there it is. Any kind of cake is good cake, generally speaking. I can't make a cake while I'm streaming. That would be difficult. Yeah, store cake is just as good. Wonderful. You've always been the clever one, you know. Okay. And now the scythe is ours. All right, it's up to you. I'll be waiting for you in the hall. Dude, you're not doing anything. You're just gonna let me fight the demons with a scythe while you stand there and stare up the stairs, huh? Okay. Dang, I'm pretty good with a now scythe. We've taken care of the ghosts. We can investigate the second floor. Now that we have taken care of the ghosts, how about I have taken care of the ghosts? I see you're waiting for me to go first. There's the magician and the creepy dude again. Broken mirror. That's rusty. Don't be deceived by this empty hallway. There's a secret passage around here somewhere. A lamp with multicolored smoke will help us find it. That's very specific. Here, this yellow elixir should make your search easier. Why did you have that on you? Yeah, I, I don't know. Yeah, lots of swords, actually. There's a handprint. There's a cool castle. Oh, there's something behind the picture. A safe. Oh, and a key. I need a key. I guess we need the other tumbler, though. Oh, wait. Do you know how he said there was probably a secret passage in this room? I'm going to give you a moment. Can anyone find the secret door on the back wall? It's secret. Let me give you a hint. Here it is. See? It's been wallpapered over, so it might be hard to notice. You... 
Shush, Erdite. Baron, the Baron's charm, deadly as a spider's cobweb, has drawn many victims to their end. A piercing needle here, a wooden doll there. Voodoo is more than a hobby for the Baron. Not entirely sure if that's racist or not. Also, a witch doctor is not a cryptid. Okay, we only got a couple dozen. James is trying to use us to make himself famous is more what it sounds like to me. All right, let's go open up the clock because that's what the key is for. Baron Samde? That is not what I'm familiar with. But probably still not a cryptid. Oh, look, see another spider web. I think those are tarot cards. Pretty sure. Okay, this is blood elixir. This is green elixir. And this is an oil can. Really? Actually, the art in this game is pretty good. Don't mock the artists. The artists did a good job. Except for on dude's hair. Door handle. Where did I need it? Oh, is that for this? Nope, I didn't think so. Where do we need a door handle? That one's got a handle. Is he a god or a person? Aha! We finally have a handle for the werewolf door. Looks like this guy couldn't get the door open either. Godish. Okay. Still not a cryptid. That's more like mythology. Well, that's pleasant. Okay. I can even see that there's something bad going on in here. Yes, that makes sense, hot punk. <clears throat> Yeah. Still probably doesn't belong in the same list as werewolves and vampires. And especially if they are generic werewolves and vampires as opposed to like Dracula and... Is there like a specific werewolf? Like in any kind of lore? The spot for book shaped tiles. I don't know. I think all werewolves, if I remember correctly, are all kind of... How many swords does it take to kill a werewolf? One, two, three, four, four. I kind of figured that, yes. That was a really good villain in that movie. This appears to be a magic lamp. It's powered by special elixirs. What? He did need another song. What, why are we making a magic potion at the instruction of our detective compatriot. Is he a bad guy? Probably not. All right, I guess we need a blue elixir. That's... So how do I get the swords? Okay, oh, more nails. I still need a hammer. Um, another knife. Why do I need another knife? Someone was sharpening... Oh, something was sharpened. Who's calling me now? I thought I turned off my phone! I'll have to file the grate open. That's a terrible design for a, gr or a fireplace. Looks like Werewolf was going to uh, stabinate his vampire friend. Kid 3 does not get to stream until Kid 3 is old enough to get an account. He is not. It's fastened too well. Can I use the knife? Probably not. Nope. That would break the knife. Yeah, but that's a creature called something. I meant a specific uh, villain type. Like, Dracula is a vampire. As opposed to a different specific type of werewolf. Uh, what did that just give me? Oh, the book. You are not going to date the werewolf. The werewolf has been impaled by four swords. Sorry. Oh, we get to paint by number. 
Okay. Sure. Oh, that's lame. Uh Aw, oh, they're little pink boys. The greatest thing that can happen to a kid is to find a really good friend. I was lucky to meet Richard. We went on many adventures. We went on many adventures together, always knowing we had each other's back. Uh-oh. Apparently it didn't last long. Whoops, I missed. However, life sent Richard and me down different paths until finally the day came when we had to choose a side and we chose differently. That looks like a week later. Okay, they look creepy now. Our friendship was cast aside, and Richard and I grew to be terrible enemies. The die had been cast. Both of us would do anything to win and make the other guy lose. So very nice. Oh, there's the rune. I guess we're leaving the werewolf pinned to the bedpost with swords. Oh, look, it's the last bottle of elixir. I guess I still don't have a hammer, though. Why did dude know that we needed to make a multicolor elixir and then have a third of the thing needed to do so? That is slightly sus. Ooh, look, another card. Okay. If I knew tarot, I could probably figure out which ones they were. All right, let's find the quote unquote secret door. Wait, how come that didn't work? Oh. Yep, that was where I saw it. Wait, where did he go? He's gone. <laughs> it's not even locked. What is this nonsense? It would take days to melt this much ice, but perhaps we can break it. I think she did. I'm pretty sure you can just leave her in there, guy. Several pieces to this missing. Okay, we need another key. We need another piece of a puzzle. That's actually a really cool picture. Um, there's something in the cabinet, but the ice is blocking the way. That could be an issue. Here, let's set it on fire. No? Same. Um, that didn't help us at all. Yeah, because we need pictures for this. We need something to break that with. Like a sledgehammer, I guess. Oh, what's this? The cupboard is locked, but I could lift the latch with something thin, like a knife. Ta-da! Aw, they took my knife. That says werewolf. And this is the thing for the safe. Wait. Didn't we need to unlock it first? It was just opened? I guess that's why they hid the thing. Dragons were born to fly, but this one can't. Actually, those dragons don't tend to have wings. Okay, uh, this is a bear's head medallion. Where did we need another medallion? In here? Oh, no, that's that. That we need a file for. Over here? Yes. 
Oh, that must be a picture, a piece of the picture. Like a gnome. And there's a file. I guess all we need here is the nails. Yes, I know they fly, but they don't need wings to fly. I think the game is implying that we need to find wings for the dragon so he can give us something. Why would you... Never mind. A tuning fork, but it's brutally hot in here. I think my little friend can stand... You want that poor little butterfly to pick up that giant tuning fork? Okay, well, I guess it's pretty strong. And she's gonna hand it to me even though it's burning hot? Okay. Alright, I need a clipper for this. Uh, what, what do I need a tuning fork for? Do I need to do anything in here? Oh, I still need the card in here. Let's go back upstairs. I could break the mirror more. Oh, the tuning fork is to break the ice. I don't think that would work. Also, you can't hit it against yourself. She might be able to think clearly away from this room. I'll get her settled in a safe place. You should stay and look around. There must be a key to the secret room here somewhere. Aren't we in the secret room? Also, isn't she dead? I don't know. He crazy. Okay. That put us exactly back where we started from. I still don't have anything. I don't have anything new. And we don't have any new rooms. Ha. Huh. Okay. Let, let's stop for a minute. Everything's done out here. Oh no, he needs eyeballs. But this and this, I need nails, but I don't have a hammer. We did this, we did that. There's nothing on the walls in here. This we need a rose for. Uh, there's, oh wait. Oh no, that's just a card. Yeah, there's nothing else in here except for the card. I don't think there's anything in here except for the card. Right? Yep. And in here we need these swords, but I can't take them for some reason. And I need something to clip that metal. And I also need a nail puller. And that's another card. What's upstairs? The mirror's broken, but we don't have any pieces of the mirror. Can't put the swords on the walls because we don't have them. He needs wings. And in here we need a key and a first aid. Oh, what are those called? The thing with the snake and the cup? I forget the name of that. Oh, we missed this. When I say we, I mean me. What is that? Well, I guess that's for a magic globe of some sort. It's not a snake stick. Spigmometer? That's not a real thing. Even though it sounds like a real thing. Is that a real thing? The garden. Uh, I guess we need clippers to un unin Ivy Mary. It's a weird place to have a hook for a paintbrush. Sphygmometer. That actually makes more sense. That's what that thing is called? With the snake? Huh. I've heard that word before. This must be the Baron. And someone threw him into the rose bushes. That's gross. I think there's magic, though. So someone just going around and murdering all the people in this hotel? Or are they killing each other? The crystal ball is stuck. Okay, I bet this is where we put the cards. 
I just closed the game. Good job, me. I meant to close the little window, and I closed the entire game. I mean, vampires aren't magic, right? Aren't they like natural, quote unquote, phenomenon, but mythological? Are they? They don't have, oh, uh, I guess they do have magic. They can turn into bats and stuff. Werewolves don't have magic. Werewolves just turn into werewolves. I just clicked off the game. Here at the True. Let's try that again, shall we? Without closing the game this time. I think most of the time you're right that vampires are in fact magic. I wasn't really thinking about it like that. Werewolves, not so much. And I guess magicians are definitely magic, if anything is. Yes, it is in fact a terrible name for a hotel. Oh, there's the clippers. Clip, 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 clip. I do a lot of gardening in these games. Ah, one of the dragon's wings. And we need a star. Now we can unbury Mary. I'm pretty sure that that is not from Supernatural. That is from Judy, uh, Judaism um, mythology. Did you hit a button? I don't know if you hit a button. I can't see your computer. Oh, you mean with Punk? Yes, yes, you did. I, I, yeah, no, this kind of dragon doesn't have that kind of wings. Those are Western wings on an Eastern dragon. Who said it? Oh, it was Locke. I'm sorry. I misread. I wasn't looking carefully. I was worrying about not closing my game. Ah. Okay. Sure, why not? <laughs> you guys are ridiculous. I don't know if it's the same on your screen, but you guys are completely different colors, too. Lot, you are like a yellowish color, and Locke, you are like a light blue. And Erdite is also a light blue, so you'd think I would get you and Erdite mixed up, as opposed to you and Ott. What do I need these tiles for? Oh, I got a hammer! Does it have a claw on it? Let's find those nails and see if it, we can get the nails. I remember there was some in the werewolf room. Aw, really? Dang it. Okay. So, that gave us a hammer, but we need a nail puller, not a hammer. Supernatural was perfectly fine until they killed the bad guy, and then it was stupid. I don't know what season that was, but it was dumb. Because I can't use this, right? Yeah, no. Can I just hit this? No, I guess not. Butterfly. Better look for... Okay, I guess I need the, crisp, the cards to get the crystal ball. I don't know what I need a firefly for. I need a flower for this. What else do I have? I have a pin. Huh. This game doesn't give you, like, very close, like, or not close, very consistent direction. Oh, well, that's just the card. I don't have any mirror pieces. I need the crystal ball for here. I need more pieces of the painting for there. Oh, can I use the pin to open the drawer? There we go. Another card. I think that says justice. And that must be the other eye for the gargoyle. What's it called when you have two different color eyes? I always thought that looked cool. I knew a kid in first grade who had two different color eyes. It was really neat. Actually, I think his name was Michael. I don't remember why I know that. 
I don't know why I remember that. Now to restore the surface. What, am I doing painting restoration now? Wait, I'm just... There's nothing on that paintbrush. That's not how painting restoration works. Mary Sue syndrome? That's cute. Alright, let's see. Binoculars. Hourglass. Four comets. One. What's that? Oh. Two. And another one. Three. What else? A letter. Like a letter letter? Yes. Four chalices. I thought there were a lot of those. Oh, there's the other one. That's not a chalice. That's an urn. There's a hookah. Clover and a ship. Oh, there's the chalice. That is one of Steve's favorite um, gaming... I've forgotten the word for it. It's not world. That's a comp... Oh, no, it's a sundial. Not campaign setting. That's the word I was looking for. That's one of Steve's favorite campaign settings. Is that a lion? Nope, that's a wolf. There's the lion. There's the compass right in front of me. Right in front of the sundial. Duh. I need a dark sun. Oh. I don't think that's how that works, but sure. Realm? Yeah, that's campaign setting was the thing I was thinking of, but yeah, realm would work. I think it's campaign setting, though. Clover charm. Where did we need that? Not here. All of these areas are kind of generic. I think that's what's throwing me off. Because I remember needing a clover charm, but I don't remember where it was. And usually I remember that kind of stuff. Here we go. That is a spider web. A magic cloth. Okay, this is to dust the cards off. It wasn't a feather duster. It was a dusting cloth. So now I have to remember where all of them are. There's one here. That's pretty decent animation. Okay, I need seven. No, oh, there's none there. None in here. Oh, there's one in the clock, though. It really is. I mean, it looks cool. One in the clock. It's a very interesting color choice for the cloth, too. It sort of looks like 80s goth. one over here too nope those are the nails okay and i got the one in the clock there's one in the safe and one in the drawer where's the last one is it in the cabinet yes i think it's in the other side of the cabinet Is Werewolf a tarot card? I didn't think so. It seems like I would remember that. Because I would think it was dumb. What takes a living being's last breath? Death? Okay. You are as smart as you look. Oh, brother. What has been the vampire's enemy since the beginning of time? The sun. 
You might be a genius. Okay, can we just skip to the questions? What do people demand when they are wronged? Justice. Some of these are act- whoops. Some of these are actual tarot cards. Oh, for heaven's sakes, just continue, please. Who bears his teeth like an animal? Well, technically both of those, but we'll go with werewolf since you said animal. <sighs> what brought death to the werewolf? A sword? Oh, you mean in this particular instance, yes. You're as smart as you look. I know. I'm a genius, apparently. What keeps the secret of an ancient order? Apparently a hotel. Because that makes a lot of sense. You guessed correctly. How do you know I guessed? I knew that one. What reveals the werewolf's true appearance? The moon. Where does today me yesterday? That's a better uh, riddle. You're actually going to ask me a question when there's only one left, huh? Who whiles away his time in pitch darkness? Well, it doesn't have to be pitch darkness. It just can't be in the sun. That was, in fact, easy as pie. You are correct. That was it. That's, I don't need those cards at all. Yes, yes. The Egyptian afterlife is canonically correct in the Sesame Street universe. Though I would have to say the Sesame Street universe is probably our universe because... Isn't it? <laughs> he's not terrifying. He's awesome. He's just a little kid bird. I mean, he did, but... What on earth? Why is- Did he just fall through the floor? Wait, where'd the other guy go? Wait, okay. I was watching that and I literally didn't understand what just happened. James went for the other dude and the floor collapsed and both of them fell? There's a, uh, I mean, there's screws here. I could just unscrew it, but sure. Let's find a wire cutter. He's very lucky it didn't kill him. He needs medical attention, but first we must release him. That makes sense. Ooh, a nail puller. No pliers, huh? There's another lightning bug. I guess we need, or a firefly. Pizzle? Oh, yes. Puzzle. And yes. I can pull it again and again, but it won't bring any results with this empty space in the middle. Oh, I didn't notice that they were missing one. Why is there a sad gingerbread man? Oh, that's a voodoo doll. <laughs> that's not a sad gingerbread man at all. <laughs> this hotel was built in place of these ruins, but what were they before? A temple? What ruins? This... Oh, it's fading in and out. I mean, it looks like the ruins of that exact hotel. So, I, I don't know. Do I need that? Okay, I still have- I got lots of nail pullers now. I guess we're gonna go pull some nails. And leave this dude hooked up to that electric machine. Now I have to remember where the nails are. Uh, there's none up here. Is there some in here? No, I think we're done in here. Unless I can get them out of there. Nope, didn't think so. There are some in here, though. That I remember. You, that's not how nails work. You have to do them one at a time. 
Can I cut this with that? Awesome. Good job. Can I take the swords now? Why not? Are there nails out here? No, but there's another firefly. Okay. Wait, no, I was just up there. The other ones are out front. I bet I'm building a ladder. There you go. That's how that works. Oh, I get the voodoo doll, too. Nice. Yeah, because I have na hammer, nails, and wood. That means I'm building a ladder. That's always what that means in these games. I don't think we've seen a ladder yet, though. Also, that didn't really... Oh, what's this? A ring? Oh, I knew I had the voodoo doll. Do I need a ring in here? No. Huh. What do I need a ring for? I don't remember there being a D on anything. Hmm. I definitely don't remember needing a voodoo doll. D stands for Dracula. I, I figured that. Thank you. He's dead, though. He dead. There he is. Dead. And there's nothing in here. Alright, once again, I am directionless. Place the boards on the broken ladder in the library. I didn't see a broken ladder in the library. Was I really not paying attention? I was really not paying attention. I was right about building a ladder, though. Good job, me. That's not how hammering nails works. <laughs> not unless you are a super expert. Wait, don't I want to use it to climb? Am I going to? Oh. Okay, that's fair. Oh, he looked dead. Okay, so he's not dead. I can't take his hat. Lame. He not dead. Uh, there's a box, but I can't open the box because I don't have... Oh wait, do I still have the nail puller? No, of course not. Oh, this is what all the little dudes are for. And again. See, doesn't that look like a sad gingerbread man? He doesn't have any needles in him. There's a witch and a werewolf. Uh, I guess I need more of those. I don't want to kill him with a hammer. I need the hammer for later. It shows a certain arrangement of the planets and an eclipse. Wait, there's an eclipse tonight! I never would have guessed. It's so dark in here, I can't see a thing. I can see that that's glowing. What happened to my magic cloth? There's a magic shield here. Well, magic can only be defeated by magic. Or a gun. Wait, how come I can't take them? Oh. That's fair. I will cut myself if I just pick up the mirror. There's too much ice in the hotel for such a warm season. Really? Witch. Magic, magical by birth. She can predict the future, see the past, and identify and influence the present. A knowledge of spells and potions makes her a truly dangerous opponent. She in the purple hat society? Or a red hat society, rather. Or purple dresses. That's a thing. I mean, that works too. It depends on what type of person you are, I guess. Well, it definitely makes sense for us to go get those medical supplies. Oops, I walked right past them. Let's do that. Spirits of ammonia. They're even using the correct thing to wake people up. Can I use it on him? Of course not. Use it on him. Yes, yes, they are. 
And if you don't know that series, I'm sorry. I'll put it in the description. It is the best series. Oh, thanks for that. I'm lucky to have such a competent partner. And look at this. I just happened to fall into the very room we needed to investigate. This door certainly beckons, doesn't it? By the way, here's a key I found on my way to the library. I'm sure you'll deduce which keyhole it fits into. He's gone again. How did he know this room was here and why are we looking for it? This is going back to the, I want to say the second episode, where we're literally moving from room to room and saying that we have evidence of things and we don't have any evidence of anything. Like, all I've seen thus far is dead people and people fighting each other. Fire! That would work. Oh, I guess I don't want to set the lightning bug on fire. Did we find a keyhole in the library? Remember seeing- oh wait, yeah, there is. There's one over here. Glue. Why do I need glue? Oh, I know why I need gloves. That's what I don't like about this game. I don't like that I keep getting stuff and not knowing what it's for. Because then when I get to a part where I'm supposed to use it, I have no idea what I'm supposed to be using it for. But yeah, the, the, it seems like they're not telling us part of the plot or something. Can I use that to cut this? That would work. Let's go fix the mirror. Oh, I'm actually going to use the glue for the mirror. Most of these games, you just put it together and it sticks. That's a lot of glue for that one little tube. Oh my gosh. Oh, no, I wanted to move you, not spin you. Oh, maybe I did want to spin you. Okay. Okay. Uh, and I guess you don't go there either. Oh! <laughs> I like how the image in the mirror isn't spinning when I spin the piece of the mirror. That's not how mirrors work. <laughs> I think that's normally why they don't have reflections in the mirrors when you're fixing them. Okay. Is that a dark elf? What on earth is this nonsense? I need to pry up the plank. Judging by the hollow sound, there's a niche behind it. Well, at least they're telling me why I need to pry it up. I am very confused about the plot. Like, I understand that there's warring figures and that kind of stuff, but like, where is other dude get or james getting this information from oh who are you a dryad dryads experience firsthand what the true power of nature is though they appear harmless and even vulnerable their ability to regenerate makes them nearly indestructible also i don't think dryads can turn into people i think they're just shaped like people right pretty sure this is where I need the lightning bugs. Okay. Aw, he's missing his heart. Um. A needle. I think so. Or, once again, this game isn't actually giving us all the information we need, which has happened in the past. Did I put the little voodoo doll inside? No, I didn't think so. See, like, now, what am I supposed to do? I need more direction, game. Finding certain things should be like, Oh, yes, I need to- I can do X now. And this game is not doing that. North? You just want me to go north? Isn't north a bad way to go? I forget. North by 
by Northwest. That's a completely different uh, reference. I need a phoenix feather and something to catch the firefly with. I don't know what I need here. Maybe paper? I guess not. I need pliers, which of course they didn't have with all the other tools. Left, always go left. The most leftliest. I always do the right hand rule when I'm in mazes, so I just keep going right until I can't go right anymore. Anything I need to do out front? I think I'm finally done with out front. Yes, nothing else to do out front. Shall I stab this voodoo doll? Do you want another one? I need to catch the firefly there. I need a star for there. Use the needle to pry up the plank. That's not how that works. Needles aren't strong enough to do that. Wait, where was I? Oh, through the mirror. Wrong way. You can't pry up a plank with a needle. That, that's not how that works. There's the book. An unusual hole for a key. All right, so I need a key for that. I know where the book goes. Okay, let's see. So we have to put in alphabetical order. Uh, let's see. Beowulf. One more book. Oh. Oh, there is one more book missing. Okay. Um, I have a chisel. What do I need a chisel for? Do I need to chisel something down here? Not that. This, maybe? I mean, that's made of stone. Oh, can I use it on this? Alright, technically you would also need a hammer for that, but that's fine. Fork, jar, and a bear. There's a bunny. There's a bear. That's literally a bear. Oh, it's missing an arm or something. There's a jar. There's a fork. Three jewelry. That's specific. That's a jewel, not a jewelry. Also a jewel. Inkwell. Inkwell. Three photos. One, two, three. A lock and a vase. A crown, a razor, and thread. Thought I might need that. Crown, a razor. That's a cool king. I would love to see that full chest set. Oh, where's the compass? There it is. Um, razor. Ah, oh, there's the crown. And I need to find the bear's arm. Where's the bear's arm? Up oh, there it is. Don't I need to sew it? Is it just sticks like that? Ooh, I got a jar for the fireflies. Now I can go find all the fireflies. Now I have to remember where all the fireflies. Oh, wait, I missed one. Well, I'm coming. Wait, do I need them down here though? I don't know. Caught them! Okay, where else are there fireflies? There's one in here. I don't think that works two times in a row. You have to catch them with your hand and then put them in the jar. Or have a separate cup. That works too. Also, you have to be short or you can't see them very well. Little kids are way better at catching fireflies than grown-ups. Because they can see them kind of up against the sky when they're not glowing. These are important facts that you should know. Did you just say that we have the right to bear arms? Really? That's terrible. You know that, right? I hope you feel bad. <laughs> okay, where do I need this? Oh, I need this in the mirror secret passage. 
Oh, this is just an untangle game, right? Can I just move it wherever? Yes, good. Okay. Where am I going? You go that way. Oh, you go that way. Where am I? Oh, you're not connected to anything on that end. Stop. Wait, what's crossing? Oh, it must have been too far out of the thing. The dryad is dead, I assume. You're not gonna tell me? What a terrible shame. I was hoping not to find any more victims. She appears to be a dryad. Someone has cruelly weeded her out. That's a terrible pun. Let's continue our investigation. Here, take this star. I think it'll be useful. I thought there were two factions fighting each other. Why are all these other monsters involved? Whatever was in the glass, it appears to be deadly to plant-based life. Okay. Ow. Fire! How come you're not allowed to write anything on fire? A frog and a stork and a dragonfly. And piranha, of course. What is that? Plant food. Why does it have... Oh, that kind of plant food. Illusionist. Bright clothing and sleight of hand are meant to distract their enemies so they don't expect a blow. Moreover, you should always stay alert as they always keep an, uh, an ace up their sleeve. This is a guy in the electric chair. Well, I guess we get to go back to... No, stage magicians are not cryptids. I assume. Neither are they mythological, if we were going to go that route. Like, they aren't... Why is suddenly everything getting struck by lightning? Okay, go get that. What just happened? This recipe is poisonous, but the real question is who used it? The recipe is poisonous or the recipe is for something poisonous? Probably the second, but who knows in this game? Okay. Bell, necklace, three flyers, three, three flowers, and a plier. It's 2 a.m. You need to go to bed. Actually, I've been streaming for almost an hour and a half. Maybe we should... What time is it? It's 8.30. Eh, I could stream for another half hour, I guess. Locke, are you okay if we stop or keep streaming without you? You'll miss stuff. <laughs> it is not the demo. Because I bought it because I knew we were doing the whole... Um, what you call it? The whole Haunted Hotel series, and it was on sale, or I had a coupon or something. Something to that effect. Where's the pliers? I absolutely need the pliers. There they are. Three timepieces. So this is not the demo. This is... That's not a timepiece, that's a compass. There's a clock. And a rake. I mean, that's technically a type of rake. Well, whatever. But yeah, so no, this is not the demo. We, we, I actually own this. Wait, didn't I get the pliers? Oh no, those were clippers. Pruners, even. Those weren't pliers at all. A uh, pipe and a bow and arrow. Wait, that's the bow right there. This bow needs ammunition. Thank you, I did that. Pliers, scroll, and a dagger. That's not a scroll, that's a newspaper. There we go. Wait, that's another scroll. There's a nail puller. We need a dagger. There it is. No. <laughs> Bye, Locke. Sweet dreams. 
Don't stay up so late next time. I need a pipe. I think I need... Oh. Uh. Here we go. I don't know why that got struck by lightning. I kind of didn't notice anything was happening like that until it happened. Okay, now we can move the books around. So we have Beowulf, Divine Comedy, I know the ABCs. Uh, Henriad? That one, I don't know. Hyperion, I know. H I J K L Lady of the Lake. That's not a book, is it? The Iliad is a book. Odyssey is a book, and Paradise Lost is a book. Is that night not in? Oh, I have to pull the lever. I was like, that's alphabetical order. <laughs> scissors. Why do I need scissors? Can I cut this? Oh, there's a pencil. Maybe I can draw on it. Oh, okay. Uh, I still need a feather for over here. This needs pliers, which I still haven't found. The frog is in the dryad room. Oh, no, that's the in the hallway. Froggy. Can I use the scissors on the vines? No, I guess not. Why do I need a pencil? Well, the little water wheel goes in this thing. Water wheel is named for a reason. So we need water for this. And we need a weird key for that. No. <laughs> no. <laughs> that would be amazing if they just did that once in each game. Have the water wheel go zoom! I'm totally linking that clip in the uh, description for those who don't know what I'm talking about because it was amazing. I don't know where I'm going and I don't know where I've been. What else do I need? Oh, wait. there. Where was those? Those were down here. What's the butterfly for? For the triad, I guess. I need four more of those. Lock. That's too... That's not good time to do. Okay, we don't need to take a rubbing of that. I still can't get the clippers out. Oh, scissors! Okay, you didn't need to cut that much. Yay, pliers! Actually, those are wire cutters, but that's okay. Now what do I do? Okay, that's not what I meant. Isn't there like... Oh, there it is. Cut the wires in correct succession from the first one to the fifth one. Okay. How do I pick it up? Oh, okay. Oh, I have to cut them at the bottom? That's lame. Oh. See, now usually when you cut wires, the electricity goes off. Generally speaking, unless there's some sort of short I'm not aware of. So I wouldn't suggest cutting live wires either. That's a bad idea. Don't do that. <laughs> Mourning her is going to be very sad. <laughs> I guess that one's that one. Uh-oh. Oh, okay. I thought he was looking like that at me. That was close. Death is certainly no illusion. Let's get him to a safe place. Thank you very much. None of my uh, tricks were a match for this thing. <sighs> Here, take this. I'm sure you can use it. What is it? In a, the illusionist's card. 
What do I need that for? Oh, is that to unlock the thing down here? Apparently. Oh, there's the heart, and I guess we need a key, a key that looks like an eyeball, maybe? Uh, no. No, we cannot. Um, also, I don't know where he thinks he's taking these people that would be safe. Aw, the dark elf got a heart. Be hard to guess the combination. Yeah, I'll have to agree with that. I don't remember anywhere there being a combination. And now I'm back to having the exact same stuff I had before. Can I use the scissors? Do I try to do that already? Yeah, I did. Huh. What do I need these things for? Wait, is there anything in the chair, maybe? I wonder how an electric chair appeared in the library in the first place. This is a hotel. Why is there a stone library in the hotel? We finished that. We finished this. It, it's not just a terrible hotel, it's a terrible building. Like, there's this secret room, and then that secret room, and then there's a secret cabinet over here. But I don't see any, like, rooms- there was only two rooms for people to stay in. Am I done in here? Yeah, everything's on fire, but I guess I'm done. Oh wait, what's this? I can't pull it out. If only I could pick it up somehow. With that? With the scissors? I don't know. Huh. Okay, so I need something like a jack, probably, to get the stone out of the way. We're completely done over here. Oh no, we need the swords from the werewolf. Though I don't know why. I just know that they were from upstairs. Maybe we don't. Maybe they just stay stuck in him the whole game. Oh, okay. Yeah, so there's nothing in here. There's nothing in this room. We just need... There's nothing out front. There's nothing in here except that, but we can't do anything with that. We need a code and water and a key. Some sort of plant clippers again. Oh, an ant. Something to deal with the piranhas. Um, what else? We're done in this room. I don't know what to do with that. We need a key for over here. I'm just making sure we didn't skip anything, but I don't think we did. And we need another key for there. We don't have all the pieces for this. Alright, what are we supposed to be doing? Place the paper on the secret message scrawled on the table in the secret corridor. What? That's a secret message? I thought that was part of the water wheel thing. This is not a- why is it coming out in yellow? That's weird. This game is not very clear in its objectives. Okay. I guess colors. So rain would be gray, maybe? Or dark gray, and then yellow would be the sun. And green would be the tree, and blue would be the ice. And water would be be this one? Or maybe- no! Snow is white. Duh. Got those backwards. Ta-da! A voodoo room. Alright, butterfly, do your thing. It's interesting that we have a pet that we get to keep through most of the game in this one, but it's in our inventory. In later games, usually the pet sits to the side like the hint button, and we just click on it when we need to use it. I'm glad we didn't lock it in the lantern. I would have felt bad. Oh, what's this? And so it begins. This time we win. 
1791. Judging by the dates, this happens once every 13 years. But what is it, and why do they hope to win? Well, I mean, if you're fighting someone, you always hope to win. Yes, okay, so the other game we've been playing, which is Halloween Chronicles, is absolutely hysterical. Can I just cut into it? Can I bang on it? Well, what good are you, then? Much... Isn't that a torque wrench? Why is that locked above a cabinet? What are those? These flowers look out of place in this room. I don't think they were collected for decoration. I'm more interested in the weird purple grape things. And also, this doesn't look like a voodoo room. Can we just take a moment? These are totem poles. They look like tiki totem poles. These are African masks. This is bamboo. There's another African mask. This looks vaguely Middle Eastern. And there's another African mask. Figs, maybe? They're figs. They're pretty weird looking figs, but that might be what they are. It is definitely not. Yeah, and like the the hanging swaths of cloth, that is definitely a um a Middle Eastern type motif. I don't know about all of this stuff because I'm not a scholar, but this must be the Voodoo Baron's room, even though it didn't have hardly anything vaguely Caribbean in it. Right, so we need a key for that. Uh, I need a sun over there, and I guess then the sun goes here, and then we need some sort of key for this, even though it looks like I could just cut into the top of it. All right, let's go put the feather in the library. Oh, that's the thing for the basement. Oh, that, is that? I think that's another token for the door. Yep, it's a crystal ball. For the witch, apparently. And this is the eyeball. A dragonfly and a tweezer. Oh, the tweezer is probably to... Aren't dates usually wrinkly, though? Maybe those are dried dates I'm thinking of. This is to get this out. Ta-da! Ha 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 ha. Alright, looks like we're done outside. Okay. This goes in the dryad room. Oh, and the dragonfly goes in here too. But you need to put them in order of how they eat each other. I think I saw this spike plant before under very sad circumstances. Yeah, it's the one that ate the dryad, isn't it? Those are sunflower seeds. <laughs> Erdite, that's not nice. <laughs> Funny, but wrong. Uh, this is probably the... Oh, wait, I got I can get some water for the little uh, water wheel on the desk. Yes, I can't sco scoop up the fishies, though. They'd probably bite me. That's not really how that works, either. Also, I could have just spun it with my hand. Ah, uh, the key is for up here, though. Okay, another thing. What is that? Lock picks. Is that for the suitcase? I think you need to do them individually, but sure, whatever. Oh, this looks interesting. Oh yeah, this is very voodoo. I am not an expert, but I'm pretty sure this is like every culture on the planet in here that sort of looked like it might be related to a black person. Yeah, nothing says voodoo like our dream catcher or a 
native necklace or a banjo or a hookah. All right. Knife, knife, or lots of knives. <laughs> um, that's a cigar case, not a cigarette case. A cane. I thought I just saw the cane. There it is. That's a pretty cool cane. Three lizards. One... Two. That was an iguana. Three. A slingshot. Oh, there's a knife. And a boot. Boot, boot, boot. There we go. That's a tambourine. That looks like it's from the Pacific Northwest. Why do I need scissors? Okay. I guess I'm cutting the sun out. Sure. Uh, a papyrus and a whip. Papyrus? is Egyptian. Just so we're clear. And it's got an Egyptian god on it. Goddess, actually. Pretty sure those animals are all from Africa. And voodoo, I'm pretty sure, is from the Caribbean. So, is that the whip? Yep, a whip and a slingshot. There's a slingshot. And a mask. Oh, the mask is missing an eyeball. There we go. Yeah, that's not great. Not great. It's a Venus flytrap. Uh, it doesn't eat plants. It, it eats bugs. It won't eat plant food. Okay. That is a brooch. I don't think I need a brooch. I think I might be able to open the door in the basement now. I can't remember if I needed three or four more of these. Ooh, three, three more. Okay. It's supposed to be a dowsing rod? What? Oh, okay. I have to put the three things that are similar... Huh. Okay. We are so close to victory this time. Closer than at any time before. But something's gone wrong, don't you see? We've got to stop this. Who was talking? The guy who died, or the guy who killed him? That was supposed to be a necromancer? This is a terrible piece of work. Someone stopped this man's heart. What an awful way to go. I assume you didn't see the villain's face. It would take someone powerful, but who? We better find out. Okay, we are an hour and 45 minutes. Yes, the skull guy just died. And I hate to break it to you, but there's no way I'm going to get to edit something longer than an hour and 45 <laughs> anytime soon. So I think we're going to stop here. This game is confusing. Where? I want to go back to the menu. There we go. It doesn't make any sense that it's happening in a hotel. It doesn't make any sense that these all, all these groups of people are being listed as the same type of being either cryptids or mythology or yeah the dude we're working with james seems to know way more than the plot is telling us and all of the people who have been in the game so far are either dead or incapacitated so I, I'm not entirely sure what's going on. <laughs> um, I own this one, and we are going to do the whole Haunted Hotel series by gum. And uh, so we'll come back to this one. But I think we'll do uh, the, the next bit of the Halloween Chronicles next, because everyone has decided that Dad Who Takes Photographs is the best character in these games so far. 
and they are not wrong. <laughs> so, I promise I will not OD on candy corn before I see you again. And I hope you don't either. I'm fate touched and I will talk to you later. Bye.